I ended up at Washington University because I had a myriad of interests coming out of high school. And so I looked at schools that offered a joint major in drama and math. And I visited WashU and felt such warmth and such love. Every campus is unique, but this is Midwestern. Hi, we love you. Come join us. We want you. And everybody wants to be wanted. While Barbara Shapps Thomas studied math, her most memorable moments were in the theater, where she performed in productions such as Cabaret and Fiddler on the Roof. My favorite professor at Washington University was Herbert Metz. He was an acting teacher and a drama teacher. He was a passionate, creative man. He was an inspiration. When I left WashU, I went to the California Institute of the Arts out in LA to get an MFA in acting. And I realized, as well as Mr. Metz had prepared me for the industry, I was not prepared for the realities of life as an actor coming from the Midwest. Ms. Shapps Thomas went on to earn a graduate degree in accounting and embarked on phase one of her career. Her competitive spirit and moral support from her family propelled her success in the corporate world of entertainment. My dad, during one of my trips home from CalArts, told me, Barbara, this is the time of women in business. You should claim your time. Going to get an MBA was getting the tools necessary to go into business. It did not teach me how to think. Washington University taught me how to think. I went into accounting and I quickly got bored and then finally found my lifetime job at HBO. It was interesting because I ended up at a media company and it was a culmination of all my passions. They came to me and they asked me, are you willing to help run this company in LA? And I had a three-year-old son and my husband who was a Wall Street investment banker said, Barbara, this is your shot, you should do it. Go for this. We turned the network into E! Entertainment Television. That made my mark at HBO. One of my biggest sources of pride is my son Jeremy, who's a Wash U alum. I think he would consider this the most important accomplishment from his time here, is he met his future bride, Emily. They are loving, caring, involved people that I am so proud to have as my son and daughter-in-law. And I think that was heightened by their arts and sciences education. I chose Barbara because she has had such a tremendous effect on arts and sciences. She's personally affected me greatly. Barbara and I first met when I became a Dean of Arts and Sciences. She now is not only a tremendous advisor as chair of the National Council, but also as a friend and a colleague. When I first started, she and David took me out to dinner and they had some advice about how to be, if you will, an executive. And it was really interesting because this was a realm that I wasn't experienced in at all. And I've certainly taken it to heart and it's been extraordinarily useful. What motivates me is to see the success of young people who come through our scholarship program. They blossom, they are able to go after what they want, they assume the passion of their lives. Since retiring from HBO, Ms. Shapps Thomas has returned to her roots as an actress and also finds time to serve in many leadership roles, including chair of the Arts and Sciences National Council, Arts and Sciences chair of the Leading Together campaign, and serving on the Washington University Board of Trustees. Barbara and her husband, David Thomas, have endowed chairs for faculty, scholarships for students, so it's just been an amazing contribution to the university. The humanities teach people empathy. They teach people how to discern truth from fiction. They teach people how to step into other people's shoes. And to me, that is the most critical need of today.